DRL, differential reinforcement of low rates of behavior. <sighs> no. Sorry, my brain's moving too quickly. I'm trying to reinforce it as it slows down. You get the idea? All right, so we're just gonna reinforce a lower rate of responding. Okay, so whenever the organism, the person, whatever is engaging in fewer behaviors per interval or per minute per hour, per, whatever, you know, maybe you're doing the whole session, whatever. So whenever they're engaging in fewer behaviors, you can drop a reinforcer on them, right? So the idea is, is that over time, you drink it. <laughs> if you really drop it on them, it might actually be punishing. <laughs> and there's a funny thing for you. Anyway, um, so no, deliver a reinforcer. Um, when the behavior is at incurring at a lower rate than what it was in the past. Um, over time, you're going to see that this slows the behavior down. It sounds kind of odd, and some people get a little confused because you're really reducing the rate of a responding using reinforcement, and reinforcement strengthens behavior. Kind of. It reinforces the current rate, right? So you have to think of behavior as a little more molar. It's not quite as molecular as what most people think of it. And as a result, you can reinforce a rate of responding. So when that rate slows down, deliver a reinforcer. Rate slows down, deliver a reinforcer. Um, if it's happening at too fast, then you might want to think about one of the other DRs, like uh, maybe a diminishing rates or something like that, or a duration issue that you're trying to change. So anyway, differential reinforcement of low rates of behavior.